As far as I know, Sporif's async patch for the XVK should help reduce stuttering by delegating the shader completion process to a different thread from the main one, which would otherwise be momentarily halted by such operation. Hence, I decided to compare its performance in terms of stuttering with Bear the XVK, latest version, in those same games as my previous video. Before that, a note on the async installation procedure. After placing the correct DLLs next to the GameXE, in order to really activate the patch, you need to open environment variables and add this new system variable. Mind you, this extra step is mandatory if you want it to work. Now let's begin our comparison with AC Origins. As you will notice, Async stutters one more time than Bear, but its frame time spikes are so much briefer that the graph doesn't even detect them. A fact that's reflected in their respective cache sizes after one bench run. The patch is working brilliantly. Just Cause 2 also seems to stutter a little less with async. In fact, its cache is almost 11 times larger in the end. In contrast, Crisis with a patch DLL shows more and higher frame time peaks during the first bench loop, especially at its start. And indeed, Bear the XVK proves itself capable of compiling a beefier cache.
finally GTA 4, the classic weirdo of the situation. Async or not, there seems to be an equal amount of slight stuttering, mainly at camera changes. But the oddest thing is this. While both Async and Bear 2.0 create a cache file, albeit of different sizes, Bear 2.1 does not, and so far I don't know why. As I continue to investigate, let's recap my observations and decide what could be the best DXVK flavor. Although Async appears to be the most rational choice, there are a couple of important factors that tip the balance in favor of the original project. Not only does the latter constantly improve its compilation capabilities, but also the former is most likely deprecated. Sad story. Anyway, we will see what the future holds in terms of solutions to compilation stuttering. Many thanks for tuning in and fare you well for now.